Welcome to our Uke Like the Pros lesson. I'm Terry Carter. Thank you for being here. We're going to try something new today, and that's a review day. <clears throat> so we're going to play everything that we've gone over in the last four days. This is very similar to things that I do during my classes. <clears throat> Monday we went over... Folsom Prison, Blues, Johnny Cash, although we just did the intro. Then we went over... Mexican Hat Dance. Then we went over a music reading song as we gather at your table. And then we did a lesson on Margaritaville. And that one, we did the whole song. We sang it, we played the intro, verse, chorus, and we did the whole production at it, backing track and all that stuff. So thank you for being here. Thank you for liking and subscribing. The Facebook's going way up. The YouTube's going up. So thank you for all that. These daily lessons tend to jump around. If you're looking for a little bit more consistency, you're looking for a step-by-step -step guidance on your journey here as a ukulele player check out ukulelepros.com i have my membership site up it's got a great level one course for beginners a level two course and i load up lessons every week and we're close to 100 lessons at this point it's just constantly growing so check that out you definitely will not be disappointed I've been experimenting with some music on the screen, so let's go ahead and jump into our first song today, which is Folsom Prison. Now, this one is slightly different because I can put it here below me, but I have some other options for us as well. Now, this is the normal music notation, so what you see here on the screen is this. The intro. Now, if you don't read music that well, that's okay. I got you. I totally got you covered here. And I got the tab version. So I'm calling this final review or final exams because I'm finishing up some summer school classes that I teach at some of the colleges. And so I just thought, end of the week, let's focus on what we've gone over already. Because sometimes we go through so much material, you don't get a chance to replay stuff again. And so today, I'm not going to go over things like a tutorial, but we're just going to play them together and see how you do. Don't forget we are live. Feel free to ask a question, leave a comment. I'd love to hear from you and I'll get back to you as soon as possible if you're uh, watching this not live. So don't let that stop you. And I see we got a few people checking in. Chris is here and Mary's here. So yay. <clears throat> Always love having my friends here with me. All right, so here we go. We're going to do our first one of four today, Johnny Cash. This is our... Uh, Intro here to Folsom Prison Blues. And remember, we start on the and of three, so when I count in, it's one, two, three. Let's do that again. Here we go. One, two, a one, two, three. the heck why don't we do it one more time it's so short and i love this intro one two a one and two and three there's song number one the second song we did this week was mexican hat dance so let me do a little fancy studio work here let me see how this works for me so mexican hat dance is right here and there, and voila, so Mexican hat dance. Now what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna give you just the whole music on the screen for a second. 
That way you can take a picture of it or have it. So there's Mexican hat dance. And now I'll bring myself back in so it doesn't feel like you're so lonely playing without me. All right, so Mexican hat dance. Let's see how you progress with this one this week. We won't go too fast. We'll go da 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 So here we go. One, two, mm, ready, and... Now repeat. So that one is a classic that everyone has got to know and it's a little trickier than you might think, especially because we're all over the ukulele neck for this one. So why don't we do it again? This time, I just want to bump us up just a little bit, so. Right there. Da 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 da. One, two, one, two, ready, and. So that's our second song that we worked on, Mexican Hat Dance. I was pushing you a little bit, tempo-wise. If that's a little fast for you, that's okay. Slow it down. But I'm here to try to push you out of your comfort zone and get the most out of you. That's my goal. And I'm surprised it took me so long to do something like this because every time I teach a class, we always review what we went over the class before, before I present new material. But here, we've just been doing a new lesson every day, new lesson, new lesson. And I'm thinking... Let's review these things because they're great lessons and we don't want to forget about them just because we are on to a new day. So that's where it came from. So two days ago, then we gave a music reading lesson on a hymn that was sent to us by one of the Uke Like the Pros members, Steve. And we, I went over it, broke it down. So let me pull this one up. So I'll, I'll bring it up to you first so you can see the whole thing here. And this is called, As We Gather at Your Table. And it's an A-A-B-A form, which means you got the first line and the second line are identical. Then the third line, which we're calling the B section, is different. And then the last line is identical to the first line. And bring me in. We also worked on some hammer-ons and some pull-offs for this particular reading lesson which could be a little difficult if you're not used to hammering on or pulling off. But they're great practice and they're great things to work on. All right, so let's go ahead and take it from the top. I see Carol's checked in. So hey, Carol. So we're, we, got, we got our international uh, France covered for this one. So thank you for being here. All right, so here we go. This is in the key of G major. And G major has one sharp, which is F sharp. So G, A, B, C, D. And I got to go back down, right? So G, A, B, C, D. And then back down, C, B, A, G, F sharp, E, D, E, F sharp, and G. So remember, all these were done in previous lessons. So if you need the tutorials on them, go back and check these lessons. This is just our plane. So here we go. Don't give up on me here. Make it to the all the way to the end, even if you miss a lot of notes, keep those eyes on the music and keep it focused. And our first note, just as a reminder, is our second string, third fret, and I'm using my second finger. So one, two, three, four, so. Second line, and. Now 
here's that B section and Last line. It's a really nice piece. It's very melodic. It's got a lot of repetition, mainly focusing on quarter notes and half notes. And I like to also in my classes just kind of start and go to the end and not give you a lot of chance to restart and just see how you do because you got to push yourself remember what i was saying earlier you got to push yourself and even though you may not feel like you're growing all the time you will slowly keep progressing up keep on getting better and better and our last song for today for our final exam for this week is margaritaville and we did two things. We mainly just worked on the chords and then I sang it. And if you like to sing, I always give extra credit for singing. So sing along with me. I did not teach the intro to this song yesterday, but I did put it up on the screen. So here's the intro when we play it. So there's the intro for it. So go ahead and grab that if you need it. And then I will put up the actual chart for this song, which is that. Okay, so let me put up the chart now. This is... So this is what we're playing. The intro, the verse, and then the chorus. And then when we finish the chorus, we're gonna go back to the verse, back to the chorus, and then we're gonna do that yet one more time and another verse and another chorus. Now this isn't, as I mentioned yesterday, exactly how the recording is. They have a little solo section in between and a few different things, but that's okay. This is everything you need to know. So if you can play all this here, then you can play the original version. Now I'm gonna sing for this one. Okay, so grab your lyrics if you need your lyrics. All this stuff is posted up at the Rock Like the, uh, excuse me, Uke Like the Pros site under the masterclass. So you can grab all this stuff if you need that additional help. And I have my backing track here. <clears throat> and let me just play a, a short little snip of the backing track so you can get the tempo. So here's, here's our backing track. One, two, three, and. tempo for the song. If you don't want to play the intro, you can just play the chords written on the top, which is just D, D, A, da, 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 two measures of D, and then I'm nibbling on sponge cake. So you can do that if you want to not play this intro, because the intro is not overly difficult, but at this tempo, it can be a little challenging. All right. Shall we? Let's do it. Okay. I'll count us in. Let me just turn this up with just a hair. Our backing track. And we're off. Here we go. One, two, three, and... D. Now here's your verse right here. And... I'm nibbling on sponge cake. Watching the sun bake All those tourists covered with oil I'm strumming my four string On the front porch swing Smell those shrimp, they're beginning to boil Here's our chorus Wasting the way again in Margaritaville Searching for my lost shaker of salt Some people claim there's a woman to blame But I know it's nobody's fault 
back to the verse and I don't know the reason I stayed here all season nothing to show but this brand new tattoo but it's a real beauty a Mexican cutie how it got there I haven't a clue Forest Wasting away again in Margaritaville Searching for my loud shaker of salt Some people claim there's a woman to blame but I know it's my own damn fault. One more time to the verse. I blew out my flip flop. I stepped on a pop top. I cut my heel, had to cruise on back home. But there's booze in the blender. Concoction that helps me hang on. Let me hear you sing it here. And wasting away again in Margaritaville. Searching for my lost shaker of salt. Some people claim there's a woman to blame. But I know it's my own damn fault. Whew, what a great song. What a fun song to play and sing. I wish we were all together and at the beach playing this one. All right, so there's your final review. How would you grade yourself? Hopefully A+. Plus. You might notice... Oh, okay, I could work on this a little bit more, could work on that a little bit more. We all can use work, including myself. So hopefully that was a nice evaluation. And uh, I really appreciate you being here. And as always, I will see you in the next lesson.